Paulo. Questions. Anybody have any questions? Okay, uh, let's see. Is uh, Mr. Bloomer, Mr. Bloomer didn't, didn't show up, so we'll go forward. Uh, I gave you a, a draft of Bone and Melton's proposal for our study. Uh, uh, does anybody have any question on it? Have you, have you looked it over? Uh, they're going to do hydraulic mo modeling tasks. They're going to do uh, distribution sampling, which we're going to provide the labor on that and uh, the uh, lab analysis. They're going to do a tank assessment. And they're going to pull some samples on it. They're going to do look at our flushing program and uh, corrosion control uh, assessment. We're going to look, look all the way back to the source water, which is Big Creek, and go through the through the filter plant, through the MIAC system. They're going to do an assessment on our MIAC system. And they're going to provide us with the study, uh, the hydraulic model, mapping of how, the, how our water flows, what, uh, water age associated with how it flows. And from that, we can determine where, where we may need to make improvements. Um, it, 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 you know, it can uh, vary from taking one tank out or taking two tanks out or there's, this, re this report will help, help you determine how to manage the tanks and the uh, distribution system and not have them manage us. So this will be a good report. For, for that body of work, the, the cost is $49,725. Um, that, uh, that is their cost. There will be a, a, a small amount of sampling that we will have to pay for. We, most of the, uh, some of the samples we can do in-house, some we'll have to send off, but it won't be, uh, it won't be a big uh, investment there. So, what he was going to send me uh, the contract if you all agreed to this proposal here uh, he was going to send me the uh, uh, written contract to have you sign it but it, it, it didn't get to me I'm going to have to call him back and see what happened with it but uh, he was maybe going to he don't want it huh? <laughs> maybe he don't want it no he hit the button but it, it's out there someplace <laughs> It, it, he, I can get it tomorrow, but uh, uh, if y'all do a, did a good review on it, I'd like your comment, and if you uh, approve of it, I can I can have that for Jim to sign. Uh, so, uh, any any comment on on this day? This is association with our uh, our. Uh, Commissioner's order we got, and this this will help us in working uh, on what we need to do for disinfectant byproducts. Water age is a big contributor to, to disinfectant byproducts, and uh, managing our distribution system is part of it. So you've got to start with a good model to know where we need to make improvements. <coughs> Von Melton, the only estimate on this we got. Yeah, they uh, they had uh, been our engineer on uh, some other things that we asked them to do. Uh, you you all had a have a, have a approved a contract with them to do uh, general uh, uh, engineering uh, work. So I asked them to put this together. There's nobody out there that we could get another. There, there are several, yes, yes, there are several. And the the hourly rates and or the hourly rates, I'm sure, are, are fine. But the total hours on the back, have they mm -hmm. have they given us a plus ten percent or? No. What if they go over that? This is it. This is it right here. They they didn't give us a plus ten percent or what or whatever. This is this is the only cost document I've got. Yeah. It just scares me when it says the estimate at the top, and then mm -hmm. total hours. And you don't really know if there's a cap on that or not. I can clarify that. But 
Uh, and that's just my opinion. Whether or not this is the this is this is the bottom line or is this an estimate? I, I can clarify that. And what you all suggest is my opinion. Oh, I agree with you. Yeah, I think you should clarify if it's a. Uh, See, this is a proposal, but the contract that I get that he signs, it it, it won't be, uh, you know, it won't be draft form. It'll be right, uh, right. It will be a lockdown. Yeah. Okay. I just don't like to say yeah, that's forty-nine thousand seven hundred twenty-five dollars, but it's got estimates at the top. Yeah. So you tell them up front, that's all you're going to pay. I mean, we just, we, can we just get, I mean, are we just talking about him clarifying that and then we bring it back to our meeting that we have the next one? Or can we, can we bring it up at one of our other meetings that we may have when we, uh, we may have to have a call meeting here and it's not for some other business, you know what I mean? That we can look at that thing. If you clarify, it sounds like that would be okay. Well, I think you're right. We'll have some meetings coming up to start mm -hmm. superintendent applications and yes. things like that. So then we, we can wrap this in with. We can conduct any other business we need to yeah. at that meeting, can't we, Mr. Phillips? We can. Okay. I'll you have might want to take a look at the contract before you sign it, too. I'll have contract. Yeah. I'll have contract. Yeah. I'm going yeah. to sign it. That's the right thing to me. All right. Did anybody here want to get a. I mean, and you're making. I mean, mentioning this, did you want to get any type of a, any other estimate from somebody else? Is that what you were leaning toward? Does anybody else think that that's important? Well, I think if, if Bill thinks that they're, you know, Fully capable of doing this, and, and we they do other workforces. Everybody else is probably going to be in this same ballpark, but I just want to clarify that this is what we're going to say. Didn't know you were heading toward. You know, no, I, I just asked. But and it doesn't matter who you get. You've got to monitor them. You got to stay on top of them. You can't let them deviate. You got you got to know as much about it that, as they do. And any engineer you get. I'd take forty nine thousand dollars and let somebody watch me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, well, I think so. I charge more. <laughs> you charge I more. I charge more. <laughs> you charge more to watch me. You're, you're worth it. You're worth it, though. <laughs> Even a day. <laughs> I think yeah. just get it clarified and get it in writing and get us a contract. Let us look at it so we know. I, what I thought I'd have it today, but I understand. He didn't. Uh, so we'll have some other meetings soon, so we'll just table this for more yeah. money. Now they, uh, let me make one other statement. They want they want to come in and talk to you about what they're what they're proposing. So one meeting uh, it'd be beneficial to you all to have them explain to you. What I agree. They they, they could have come today, but I had so much here going on that I, I didn't think that we could do it. So uh, they'd be glad to, and I can set something up. Uh, need to establish a committee for the uh, uh, security in place uh, bid they're due the 12th of this month and since we're having this meeting early uh, we need, need, some, need somebody to look at those bids and uh, help us decide who to go with on that I have, I've had a lot of calls about it a lot of interest, interest on it Need to, need to. You set still it. have to have. Do you need full board for that? I would think so. We do. It's whatever the full board, but it's, it's what counts. I mean, if, if you want to appoint certain members and so they can look at it, if it meets the specs, take the low bid, whatever you want to do. If you or you can just wait and let the whole full board look at it at the next meeting. It's up to you. Well, we're going to have them probably have a meeting anyway before the next month's meeting. We'll just do it, do it then. What did you say? It would be the 11th? 12th. No, but I mean, we got all these back in. We got to open the bids. The 12th. Next Tuesday. They're supposed to be publicly open the 12th. Well, then we can do that and still not vote on it until the next week or two when we have another meeting. We'd still open them on You just need to assign who's going to open well, you can. You, well, I can. Yeah. I know, but don't I have to have, need somebody else? 
With we okay with that? Well, I mean, I assume there'll be somebody else with you. Well, yeah, I mean, there's no law on you. I mean, it's always you got to have one person. I'm just making sure. I'm holding in the back over there. I'll take care of it. 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 I'll take care Y'all was okay. You can slip out the fire bed. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I shouldn't even ask. <laughs> okay. So the twelfth wheel, well, somebody open the bid. Yeah, somebody open the bid. Uh, grit, grit removal, low bid was Marion at uh, twenty-four thousand, uh, twenty-two thousand four hundred. So we recommend to look, go low bid on on that. They're capable of doing the work. Grit bid. removal, Marion. That's the only bid you had. No, we had, I had more than that bid. He was low, and we reviewed him. Specs. Hmm. Yeah. Specs. I make a motion we approve that low bid. Second. Any other discussion? All in favor, say aye. 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 Those opposed, no. Okay, diffuser bid. Uh, we're, there was only one company that met the requirements. That was Garney. Uh, and we got to looking at it, and we felt that we could uh, uh, do this type of work ourselves. It's it's just uh, it's just piping, and uh, it, it, and we think that we can do the work. We we want to go out for bid again, and include in it that we want to do the labor and. Uh, just go out for materials. Yeah, because we possibly could save fifty to seventy thousand dollars, and that's a lot of substantial amount of money. Yeah, uh, yeah. yeah. Our people—it's just putting pipes together, but uh, okay. uh, and we feel we can do that. Yes, sir. Yeah. Make a motion we rebid it for materials only. Okay. Second. Remove the second. Any other discussion? All in favor say aye. Aye. Those no. No. Okay, I, I want to go out for bid for a clarifier gearbox, uh, a camera for the sewer sewer camera, uh, a jetter, and I want to talk about it a little bit, and truck bed beds, truck beds. Uh, the jetter is uh, for back backup. <coughs> And uh, our jetter, current jetter that we have, it's on a truck. And it was purchased in 1995. Frank Neal purchased it. And uh, it, it is a piece of equipment that's vital to the, to the uh, water department on the sewer side. Um, it is now beginning to show age. We, we, we need to put a clutch in it. And we're afraid to get into it without a backup because we might get in there and find something else wrong and take a long time to fix. We have a potential of using that every day. Uh, it depends on when we have a sewer stoppage. So uh, we wanted to go for a, 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 a backup jetter, but we wanted to request a jetter back combo. It's a it's a it's on a trailer. Uh, we'd go out for bid for sure. It's on a trailer. It has a jetter system. And it has a vacuum system. Uh, the the uh, uh, vacuum system would be very beneficial in uh, several things like uh, manhole clean out. Instead of having to get down in the manhole and cleaning that out, we could use the jetter. I mean the uh, vacuum to. Uh, to pull all the debris and stuff out of the manhole, uh, it would uh, uh, it'd be a safety factor there. Uh, grit removal at the at the swirl in the uh, sewer plant and uh, and uh, other areas. Uh, there's a sludge tank uh, that comes off of the clarifier. Clarifier sweeps sludge and pieces. Just anything that uh, that floats and uh, accumulates in this in this uh, tank, we can use it for that. Right now, uh, it's it's more manual, and uh, we're using a pump to pump it out. It doesn't get clean with this jitter with this uh, uh, vacuum.
vacuum system, it would be beneficial there. And the uh, valve box, the valve uh, boxes, uh, we we have these valve boxes that where you see the valves in the streets and, and around, they accumulate dirt in those. And every time we have to uh, turn that valve, we have to physically get down there and, and pull it, pull dirt and debris out of that out of that valve box just to get to the valve. And we need to set up a program of exercising those valves. And in order to do that, you got to clean the valve box out. Well, this jitter slash vac. You could uh, use the jitter to loosen that up and then vacuum it out. And 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 we really need to uh, uh, apply some uh, manpower to, to do that. Now, what we're looking at cost-wise is around $70,000 for these, this piece of equipment, this combo piece of equipment. And I wanted to talk to you about that before I went out for bid or bid. Uh, I, I need your all's comment on whether or not to go that. They seem to think that they would be using this piece of equipment. This would turn out to be our uh, primary use uh, piece of equipment. Uh, what do y'all think about it? Y'all are the ones going to use it. It'd be handy. Real handy. And this one, you're talking about bidding one out possibly on a trailer, right? Yes, so you yeah. have any truck could pull it rather than its own, yes. its own truck. It's on a trailer. So any, any truck we got yeah. can pull it. Yeah. The one we've got is on a truck now. I know, I know. And you've got to maintain that truck. The truck's a 90, or I don't know how, how old the truck is, but it's you got to maintain old. it and, and also the, the, the jitter. It's becoming uh, fragile. So... <laughs> It's one of those things we need backup on. Well, it's, it's just request for bids. I mean, we're not yeah. buying it, so. No, you can actually see what it would go. I want, I want a direction on to which way to go on the, on it. Do, do I go for a combo or or not? I, I, I think so. Make a motion we bid the combo. Okay. No, all we're doing is putting it out there. Yeah. Are y'all going to do it all at one time? We can do them all at one time. Okay, yeah, that's fine. So, leave the motion back. So, it's Bill 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 So, he's making a motion that we're going to do the gearbox, the camera, the jitter combo, yeah. and the truck sure. beds. Yeah. Is that, is that all right? How many truck beds? Two? Three. Three? Yeah. Okay. So, three truck beds and a vacuum combo. Yeah. And Mark? Making a motion. Right? Yeah, I'll make a motion that all of those items be bid, be left for bid. Okay. Is there a second? Second. We'll Moved and second. Any other discussion? All in favor say aye. 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 Those disapproved or no? Y'all got anything? That's all I got. <coughs> Board have anything? Thank you guys for your real hard work doing that cold snack. Oh, by the way, one of those valves, and we were lucky if y'all had a freeze over here, the, the water was that time. Did y'all ever push that valve? Don't run off. You didn't cut the water off? You don't run off? That's the one time we got to exercise, yeah. Mm -hmm. we got, yeah. That was yeah, it's uh, yeah. yeah, yeah, seven good. degrees Ten now. We're out there pulling that crap out. Of that. Six fifty. Yeah, yeah. I know. Never did. Never did. Trying to decide if I want to start. I think stop and start a fresh yeah. video for the. We got the exercise. Probably should. Instead of sitting here for ten minutes, ten minutes of small talk. It's a guy.